दिस इज प्राइमरी मैथमेटिक्स बुक फोर पेज एटी नाइन चैप्टर थ्री लेसन फाइव क्वेश्चन नंबर वन अ बेकअप और फोर्टी के जी ऑफ फ्लोर शी यूज थ्री बाई एट ऑफ द फ्लोर टू बेक सम ब्रेड हाउ मेनी के जीज ऑफ फ्लोर डिड शी यूज द नेक्स्ट लेट विल इनिशिएट द सोल्यूशन ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन बाई यूजिंग द फर्स्ट टू स्टेटमेंट्स अ बेकअप और फोर्टी के जी ऑफ फ्लोर शी यूज थ्री बाई एट ऑफ द फ्लोर टू बेक सम ब्रेड सो द होल के जी ऑफ फ्लोर डेट शी हैज pot is equals to 40 kg however we don't know how much kg of flour that she used and unused we only know the fractions the used fraction is that 3 by 8 which is given which is given in the question that uh, the used parts of flour is equals to 3 by 8 well the numerator is uh, 3 which is represented through three yellow bricks and denominator is 8 that is the whole units The unused parts uh, of floor is represented through five or eight because uh, of out of eight bricks only five are the u unused one. So the total number of units uh, is equals to eight. However, if we don't know how to use the diagram and only the fractions are given, then what we have to do is. Uh, To use the formula that is written on the right side of this slide, the unused parts of floor equals equals to total units minus used units equals to eight minus three e, and the answer we get is five. This is how we have to take out the fraction five. We have to write it on the numerator side, and eight is actually the total number of units, and fractions are represented like that. the last statement of the question is uh, which is actually we have to solve this question how many kgs of flour did she use for solving this statement what we have to use the formula is total number of uh, flour equals to total kg of flour total units of flour we already know that it units and total kg of flour is uh, the whole kg that is 40 kg and we know that total units is equals to the total the whole part of the thing that she has that is 40 kg 8 units equals to 40 kg that is the equation and when we are moving from 8 to 1 unit which is called the unitary method then 8 is multiplied with the units here but on the other side of equality it is going to divide with the number that is written on the numerator So one unit equals to forty divided by eight, and one unit equals to five kg. This is the answer we get because eight times five equals to forty. Well, one unit equals to five kg, which we have taken out from the last slide. Only three parts of the floor are used. So we have to multiply the three numerator with the units on the both sides. when we are going to multiply or divide any number on the one side of equality we have to do the same thing on the other side of the equality because this in mathematics we are not going to add subtract multiply or divide only the one side we have to do it on both sides so 3 times 1 equals to 3 units and the answer we get is 5 times 3 equals to 15 kg So the answer we get is she used fifteen kg of flour. That's it from my side.